3DS owners haven't had many reasons to turn on their shiny new handheld, but in one epic swoop, Nintendo's changed that. It's amazing how even now, almost 13 years after its original release, the greatest game of all time can still change everything. This is the rebirth of a benchmark in game design. This is the refinement of one of the industry's highest pinnacles. This is the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D. I think it's safe to say 3DS batteries are finally going to start draining. The first major AAA release for Nintendo's budding new handheld, Ocarina of Time 3D is an interesting choice for that kind of high-profile release and that it isn't at all interested in taking you places you've already been. It doesn't want to show you anything you haven't already seen. Its only concern is preserving the core Ocarina experience and making only the most necessary of refinements. Now listen, I'll level with you here. Ocarina of Time is my favorite game of all time. And as you probably know, I've already reviewed it. Like, 60 times. It was my first classic game room video review. I've also reviewed the GameCube remake and the Master Quest. So, you've heard my thoughts on this game. Uh, both the objective and the gushing on several occasions. So I'm not going to get into that here. If you want to hear me analyze this game for almost 10 minutes and tell you why it's so incredible, Check out my review of the original Nintendo 64 version. Today, we're going to focus on what's been changed in this 3D port, which is, in short, nothing. I mean, Hyrule hasn't changed at all in the last 13 years, but it does look an awful lot different, and that's what Ocarina of Time 3D is all about. So the biggest change in Ocarina of Time 3D is the visual refinement. Nintendo's done an uncanny job of preserving the look of the original, but they've also given it a new coat of paint, so to speak. That is to say, the textures, the colors, the character models, it's all been given a modern facelift, and it looks downright gorgeous. But keep in mind, when I call it a modern facelift, I only mean that in terms of the technical aspects. What's striking about Ocarina of Time 3D is that it painstakingly maintains the art style of the original. I mean, it looks like Ocarina, it feels like Ocarina. In fact, you almost forget about the changes. It's like you're playing the original had the original been released in 2011 and not 1998. Ocarina of Time 3D isn't a remake, but a respectful refinement always cognizant of the massive footsteps in which it's stepping. <laughs> this is a great example of what technology can do for graphics. An Ocarina of Time never quite matched the look of the promotional art and the way the characters looked in the instruction manual, for example, but now it does. This is the way this classic was always intended to look, and if you're a Nintendo fan, well, that's reason enough to revisit Hyrule. In addition to its look, though, the game also makes some control changes, mostly emphasizing the new technology it's being realized on. You can actually move your 3DS in physical space to aim your slingshot, for example, and it works really well. It's faster, it's more accurate. If you can get the hang of doing it without messing up the 3D effect, it actually becomes your preferred method of aiming. Speaking of which, that 3D effect works really well in Ocarina. After just a little time with the game, you actually stop noticing it. What I mean is that seeing this world in 3D quickly becomes second nature. It really makes Hyrule come to life, and what's interesting is that you kind of stop noticing it. Until you turn it off and the game actually feels flat in comparison. This is a really great implementation of that 3D effect. Now, does it change the gameplay? No, but as gimmicky as it sounds, it does make Hyrule seem like a, like a living, breathing world in the palm of your hands. I could go on forever about why Ocarina of Time is the greatest game ever made, but that's a song you've heard me sing countless times before. What you might not have expected is this. Ocarina of Time 3D is an improvement to the greatest game ever made. I mean, for me, Praise doesn't get much more glowing than that. Buy it for the new boss battle mode, buy it for the included master quest, buy it for the improved graphics, whatever, just buy it.